good morning or should I say good afternoon might as well say good afternoon good evening and good night at the minute it's about one o'clock I think yeah a little bit late to the party but as you can see I've been on the, the sort my life out stage so yeah been up shower shave and uh now it's on with the day ladies and gentlemen so what are we gonna do are we gonna try to resurrect that old battery or are we gonna fit the new car ramp choices but i'll tell you one thing sun shining not many clouds in the sky pretty awesome little day on planet earth if you ask me nice let's get this day going shall we so in true andrea fashion her phone's on silent and um i've just realized that the jump leads that I need to do this little resurrection of battery are in Andrea's Civics. So she's out, she's at her mum's. Don't think I'll be doing this battery thing today. It might be a tomorrow mission, who knows? So, kind of took one out of the uh, two choices. Do I fit the amp? Coffee, and I've decided I've got a little side mission to go on. I think it's time we do a little something to see if we can change these up. Now, I am not a professional customizer of trainers. I am far from it, but I just can't, can't rock these the way they are. Got to change them up. leave that for 15 minutes and uh, wash it off see what happens who knows if it will who knows if it will work or not so uh, yeah 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 Few more minutes to wait to see if this bleach effects work disconnect all the power to the amp switch over the amp plug it all back in good times stuck on there real good right so that was the timer just going off for the trainers i'm gonna go and rinse the bleach off of them and then we'll come back to fitting the amp i got the phone off but that's uh, just a good sign of you know what don't buy cheap terminals well we've got a little bit of bleaching down the side it didn't do anything to that top fabric. So uh, I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna uh, rinse them off. I'm gonna try to get the fabric wet, put the bleach on it, and then hopefully that time it might actually like soak in. I know that's what you would normally do when you're doing t-shirts. So rinse these off, try again.
Now back to the amp. So this is like the first time this amp's been off the box since they were paired. Kind of sad times, man. It's crazy. Definitely an end of an era. Let's hope the future is better. Louder, shall we say. Amp done me well for what it was. And uh, who knows, man? We might even incorporate it somewhere else in the car and use it to run more speakers somewhere. Who knows? The other interesting thing is going to be how the cables route to this new amp. This one just worked lovely because it was side to side. The new one, everything's on the front. But all my cables run from left to right. So I kind of want the brand on the amp to be facing the right way. Uh, we'll figure it out. tiny man it's got me to thinking isn't it do i mount it on the top or shall i just mount it on the side mm. questions thoughts dilemmas drama so halfway through fitting the amp alarm went off about the bleach and it just don't I don't think it's worked man these are like impenetrable when it comes to bleach What's that all about? Right, paint markers I think it's gonna have to be, right? To do a little bit of cable maintenance or something i don't know a little bit of cable tied in because i don't want the signals and the powers and the speakers a rather inconvenient of him flying over i don't want all the cables running together and i don't want interference basically so right so that's plugged in need to wire it up front set all the gains and do all the good fun stuff see if it does what i bought it to do See how we get on. So this AM's got a pretty sweet little feature. It's got a clean in and a clean out sort of setup. So instead of having to use like a amp meters, multimeters, whatever you want to call them. You can literally just set all your settings on the head unit using music or just straight frequency. Set with a gain on the amp and yeah, pretty trick. Nice little setup, but in all fairness, one of those things, if you know how you do it, you know how you do it. That feature didn't work as uh, simply as I expected. So, uh, hmm. So just done it the old fashioned way. And uh, yeah. This just such a level of difference is unreal. So the other one, the gain used to be near enough full, just backed off so it didn't overheat and blow itself up. And it was just not even really getting the subs going. This I've got pretty much halfway and already you're like, yeah, that's all you need. System's not even really turned up. So I'm looking forward to getting everything sorted, getting all the speakers connected back up. And um, yeah, see what happens. Right, so one mission succeeded. Amps in the car. A little bit disappointed in the fact that that uh, clean in, clean out effect didn't work. Or maybe I just didn't know what I was 
maybe I needed to use a frequency over music. The first time I tried it, I know it was in a quiet part of the song, so I did try it again in the middle, in the loudest part, but no joy. Anyway, set it up the old fashioned way. Just gonna wait until I have purpose to go out to uh, really fine tune it and see what we think overall. So you'll have to wait and see what I think about that. First mission though that we tried, I think this is the bit where the wah, wah, wah plays because Dude, bleach these trainers twice. They're absolutely bomb-proof. And done nothing. Yet again, back to the drawing board on that one. I think they're obviously impenetrable to bleach. You might just have to be spray and paints and good old fashioned stuff instead of uh, trying to change what's there. We're just gonna have to add to it. We'll have to stay tuned for that one. What is up? Right, so dinner's done. I've got to go and get some petrol. So I took that as a good opportunity to get in the car, get some tunes on, and just see how well this amp set up for now anyway. Oh, good times, man. The day is just chipped on by the evening. It's chipped on by, man. It's been unreal. But never mind. It's a long weekend. Car is full. Well, it's not full, but it's got enough petrol in it to get me to work and back. Sort of matters, right? And I think on the amp front, we can go a little bit more. Bearing in mind, it's only like halfway. I know we can go a little bit more. Tomorrow, fine tune it and uh, just get it kicking. That's what we wanted, right? Anyway, on that note, I'm going to call it a day, guys and girls. I hope you've had a fantastic start to the weekend. Obviously, if you're watching this when it went live, I hope you have an awesome Sunday ahead. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for taking the time out to watch my day back. And most of all, thanks to everybody that's leaving things in the comments when I'm saying stupid things like, hey, what do you think? Leave it in the comments below. Um, appreciate it. I appreciate you guys listening and paying enough attention to even get down with the, the madness that is the vlog. So yeah, on that note, take it easy. I'll see you same time, same place tomorrow.